Hi everyone, this is a pick a card reading and this is specifically for those of you if you are feeling down, upset, anx anxious, depressed, extremely stressed, heartbroken um, or you're just not in a really good space right now. I can promise you that we all go through cycles and phases and that you will get through this, whatever you're dealing with in your life. But I'm hoping that this reading specifically will give you the knowledge and the courage to really go forward. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm just really hoping that it helps you in some way, shape or form. And if it just helps that one person out there, then, you know, it's going to make me feel amazing. And I just... I just know, especially with working with spirit guides and the divine, that I really do feel that this is going to help a lot of you. So we have here two very special groups. We have group one and group two with these two beautiful crystals. And whichever one you feel most drawn to is going to be the reading for you. So in the timestamps, sorry, in the description box below, there will be timestamps where you can go to the description box. Um, it will open up and then you can access, you know, the timestamps for group one or group two. You can click on it and it will take you to the reading and you can sit back, relax and hopefully, well, hopefully feel relaxed and watch it. Um, but also I do want to mention as well that, you know, if you'd like to win a free reading with me, do check out the description box below. I know that not everybody can afford, you know, to have um, a private paid reading but uh, the information for that is down below if you want to enter and if you want to see how you can enter if you would like to um, purchase a private paid reading information is also in the description box below they're done within 24 to 48 hours last thing I want to mention is that my intention bracelets are on Etsy now this one is very very special it is the crystal gem healing bracelet so this is what it looks like and uh, they are available on my Etsy store it is handmade it is staged it is meditated with an and um, just honestly seeing how so many of you have seen results with the items on my Etsy store just makes me so happy um, and it's it's absolutely amazing especially for those of you that are trying to heal those of you try, trying to feel you know less anxious or you're trying to work through certain things in your life right now just seeing how so many of these items on my Etsy shop have really helped you is amazing absolutely amazing so definitely do check out my Etsy shop down below also do check out the reviews as well because that is also on my Etsy store as well if you want to sort of see the results for yourself. Um, so let's begin. All right, so let's begin first of all with group number one. I'm going to move group number two to the side, to the left, to the left, everything you own in the box to the left. Not to quote Beyonce, but that is the first thing that is really coming up. Irreplaceable. Oh my gosh, wow. <laughs> Sorry, I just had that sort of, you are irreplaceable. Okay, you need to, you need to know that. All right, so that's the song anyways, the Beyonce song. Okay, so group number one, okay? If you're not feeling great, um, you know, whatever is going on and you've clicked on this video, these are the messages that you are just supposed to hear at this very point in time. So we have this absolutely gorgeous blue crystal, okay? This crystal here is sort of urging you that sometimes, you know, it's it's good for you to keep, you know, sort, sort of thoughts and emotions to yourself, but sometimes it's good to also verbally communicate it okay so communicating them to people around you um, or perhaps going out and actually seeking that so I definitely see that communication can be a great thing that can sort of just really help you we have this beautiful post-it notes that I found you know where you have um, a sort of very content cloud and then sort of you know a bit more of a uh, I guess in a in a way <laughs> you know a happy cloud as well and the thing is um, I felt very drawn to using these rainbows because you can't have a rainbow without a little bit of rain and I sound I know that sounds just really awful and not so great but sometimes we need a little bit of rain um, to allow us to make us feel stronger to appreciate um, you know so much more and sometimes it is eye-opening and it's not great no but it's gonna make you stronger and I think that's a big thing to take away from this as well now it's actually attached to one of these um, cards it's actually called the Yan, the Yan Yin transmission cards. I think that's what they are um, called, but they look like this. So it says here, wise action. There is something you can do. Consult your heart and understand how to act with wisdom. Through prayer, through thoughtful speech, right, speech and communication, verbal communication, forgiv forgiveness or taking a step. Do what you can surrender all else so it's really showing you you know take control it's okay you have got this it will be hard but take it step by step as well and you know you can pray to the divine the universe guides god whatever it is that you believe in everyone believes in different things of course um and 
you know, it's really through forgiveness. Perhaps there is someone you need to forgive. Perhaps you need to forgive yourself, you know, and, and through thoughtful speech and just getting everything out there. Sometimes it's, it's, you know, it's a burden to feel that you're feeling these things. And sometimes getting it off your chest can be a weight lifted off. So, you know, I highly recommend sort of talking about things can definitely make you feel, you know, for sure a lot better. So I would highly recommend that. Now, you got the rainbow there, right, with all of those sort of bright colours, but you know what else is bright? The chakras, very similar in sort of colours as well. And this one here is the third chakra. Now this is the solar plexus, and I have a lot of these, I think I have all of the chakra bracelets now on my Etsy store as well, and um, honestly, it's, it's amazing to see how so many of them worked. I highly recommend you to um, look at the reviews if you haven't already, but um, I know for a fact that the Solar Plexus one is doing really, really well lately. And um, what I would say to you is, you know, confidence is so magnetic and sometimes when we're down, we don't feel it, right? We just don't want to be that way. We want to you know, just feel what we're feeling and we want to sort of understand why sometimes as well. It's hard to as well understand that as well. What this is saying is self-worth and self-esteem, right? So this is just a very strong affirmation and intention. Very, very strong. Saying words like this, right? I honour myself. I love myself. You know, things like that can be really great. So this here says, I honour myself by doing things that please me not only those that please others, right? So this is about taking control of your life, doing things for yourself. If you feel burdened that you constantly have to sort of put up a front or show your life to be something that it's perhaps not, it can be draining, it can be exhausting. In On this planet, all you have to do is be yourself. That will gain you much more in terms of, you know, that emotional happiness and confidence and strength, you know, and if that has got you into this mess by being yourself, then maybe you have to evaluate, you know, what you were around. Did that actually, you know, maybe that wasn't actually for you, you know, that's, that's stuff that we have to sometimes um, understand and realise. Um, and of course, you know, everyone goes through different problems. Some people are heartbroken, other people are just de um, dealing with anxiety and, you know, and themselves and understanding themselves. And I can totally understand that. So it says here, I am empowered as I release the need to live up to other people's unrealistic expectations of me. I feel a lot of you are living, you know, trying to live up to other people's expectations of you. Um, and it says, when I respect and approve of myself others will naturally do the same so you have to question also you know if you've been in situations with other people um, where they have made you feel terrible for who you are are they really the people for you right so um, it also says I teach others how to treat and respect me by how I treat and respect myself I know I am worthy of love and respect the boundaries I create with others acknowledge my self-worth so this is first and foremost starting with yourself and then branching out so that is a very very important message cannot stress that 10 out of 10 you know this is about confidence self-esteem self-worth and self-love you know which is something that i think is really great to put into yourself and using your strengths using your weaknesses as your strengths you know not in a narcissistic egoistic way but in a way where you are feeling better about yourself and it allows you to feel good about yourself because everyone deserves to feel good you know um in that sense so we've got these cards as well so it says here water right? It's time to let go of the old and worn out so that the new can come in. You know, sometimes the new can be much better and people are afraid, you know, they 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 have to let go of, you know, familiar, familiar, oh gosh, wow, I can't even say it, familiar things, familiarity, you know what I mean? It's a hard, it's, it's a difficult word for me to pronounce. I can pronounce really, you know, challenging words, but that one, it just gets me. Um, but yes, you know, sometimes we, we want to go, we want to stay with things that are familiar and comfortable, but sometimes the best things happen outside our comfort zone. It also says here, it is safe for you to stop comparing yourself to other people. This one here is air. Okay, so we've got here water, right? Water energy, which is all about the sort of emotional side and the bonding that you can have, you know, with certain situations. And then we've got here the air energy, which is really about you, you know, not comparing yourself to others and actually being sort of more truthful to yourself and realizing that actually you have a lot of worth, you know, a lot of self-worth. So don't compare yourself in that sense, um, even though it can feel very easy to do so at the time. And then we have here fire energy and the divine wants you to know that you are very special, right? There's nobody else on the planet like you. You are very, very, very special and it's important for us to sometimes realise that. It can be very difficult to realise that, but just note that in time, with cycles and phases, things will get better, right? Um, clouds don't exist forever. They don't. You know, the sun will peek through those clouds at some point. You know, that's the thing. Darkness does not last forever. 
light will shine and it will come through. So it says here, see light within yourself and everyone else will too. So it starts from yourself and then it really just shines out. And we've got so much of that yellowy kind of fiery energy as well coming through. I really hope this helps you and um, I would highly recommend, you know, um, speaking to someone, even a counsellor or, you know, just a strong, you know, kind of like a friend or a family member if you have that option. If not, you know, there are some amazing counsellors out there that can also really help you too and it will just make you feel stronger, better and, um, you know, it, it will really just help in that sense. So I think that it can be for sure... Um, you know, a great thing for you to sort of take part in if you haven't already, but just know that there is support out there, there is light at the end of the tunnel, and you are just going through a cycle in a phase, which will get better, so please don't give up, all right, so this is your reading, and if this resonates, or if you have any comments, uh, let me know in the comment section below, don't forget to like this video, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and um, I'm going to now move on to group number two, all right, so I'm just going to... Move some of these items to the side. All right, there we go, there we go. Okay, so group number two, let's have a look. If you're feeling down, upset, anxious, depressed, sad, heartbroken, um, or even stressed, you know, this is going to be a reading where I'm hoping I can give you some more information um, on what I'm seeing. All right, so we have this beautiful green crystal. So um, green is also to do with the heart chakra specifically. So this is really about, you know, sometimes if your heart is hurting, even in regards to, you know, personal issues and things within yourself, you know, this really is about just knowing that things will get better, that things will heal over time, right? So that is really what it's showcasing there. Also, I have these beautiful, really cute post-it notes with rainbow and the clouds. Now, you cannot have a rainbow without a little bit of rain. And I know that sounds not the greatest thing in the world to say sometimes, especially when someone's going through a really hard time. But I know I can say from past experience that actually the rain that I have faced in my life has made me a much, much stronger person. It's allowed me to see the world from a different perspective. It's allowed me to grow. It's allowed me to heal. It's allowed me to become the person that I am today. And sometimes it's hard to realize that when we're going through very, very difficult times and it can feel like nobody else understands us. Nobody understands what we're going through. But in reality, there are so many people dealing with this on a day-to-day -day basis. So if you do feel alone, just know that you're not alone. You know, that there is always someone, right? So if, if you're this cloud, there is always someone that's always dealing with something else as well. You know, both of these clouds are happy, but if you sort of imagine that, you know, there are lots of people dealing with lots of problems, um, but that's not, you know, to take away from your problems whatsoever. I'm just trying to say that, you know, this is going to make you stronger and, um, you know, you will start to see the rainbow eventually. I know you will. All right, so in the back of this, we do have um, uh, a card, which I just stuck the sticky note to. Um, so I will leave the names of the cards in the description box below if you're interested in seeing which ones they are. So it says here, greatest benefit. Why concern yourself with how, when, where or whom? When you trust in the workings of my will. So this is, you know, the divine really speaking. Even in the face of the unexpected, my greatest blessings will flow into your life. So things can come unexpectedly, right? Rain, sadness, heartbreak, grief, um, may have to be dealt with just really unexpectedly, but it will make you stronger. And, you know, it's, it's a part of life, unfortunately. I mean, you know, we have to deal with these things. All I know is that happiness will come your way. You're going through a cycle and a phase, and you will get to that point where you do feel much stronger, much better, and much, you know, it will get better with time, you know. Uh, things will heal. Your heart will heal. So we have here fourth chakra. So it says heart chakra, which totally relates to this green crystal. And it says here, it's time to re rejuvenate myself by giving myself love. I accept myself the way I am. I remind myself that I cannot feel any better about life than how I feel about myself. I will not wait a moment longer to accept myself. So this is about really just accepting yourself now and saying, you know what, I accept myself. And the more you do that and the more of that affirmation you put into the universe and you say that, the more you actually are literally accepting yourself and feeling, you know, stronger and better in that sense. 
It says here, I honour what my body is asking for, and if I am unsure, I will ask myself, what can I do to be healthier and more balanced than I am now? I dwell upon all that is right in my life, not what is wrong, and I have gratitude. You know, sometimes it just is gratitude and, you know, sort of seeing, like, what do I have, you know, and what am I... Um, proud about having despite you know these problems which by the way these problems will you know they will get better with time you know you will get through them you will heal through things and you will grow through things and it will just make you stronger it's never 100 percent, you know always just gonna go away and leave you but you will get through you know you'll get stronger through it it says here i dwell upon uh, that is right in my all that is like Oh my gosh, I can't even speak. I dwell upon all that is right in my life, not what is wrong, and I have gratitude. I accept my life as it is now, and I move forwards from here. So this is about moving forward. It is about progression. And we've got this fire card right here, which says, let go of the past, embrace the light, and the joy of the new day. Every day is a new day, regardless of what has happened in the past. You will get through things. Things will progress. Things will manifest for you. You will grow stronger through things. And I think that meditation is very, very powerful. It can also really stimulate your heart chakra. So, you know, meditating, even just five to 10 minutes a day, you know, it can be difficult at the beginning to sort of concentrate on it, but it will get better as time goes by. There are lots of tutorials on YouTube on meditation or meditative techniques, so I would highly definitely recommend that to you. Um, so that is something that I'm definitely seeing right there. I think it can be really positive and a really wonderful and great thing for you, um, meditation. It says here, give yourself per um, permission to heal and it will come, right? Sometimes we block our own healing because we just don't want to acknowledge it. We don't want to do it. It's too much. It feels more painful. But the reality is the healing is what allows us to really just, you know, feel better, to feel stronger. And it allows us to sort of just see that, okay, there is a new day and I can get through this today. And it will be hard. You know, it'll be like a roller coaster where one day will be good. One day will be terrible. One day will be hell on earth, but it will allow you to feel stronger to it. And it will get better as time progresses. It, you know, you will see the sort of sun rise up and, and you will feel that energy as well. We have this one which says earth so it says this isn't what you expected to happen but trust that it's part of the plan okay so sometimes certain things happen because they're just meant to happen we're on you know we're on different paths in our lives and some things will happen that are just unexpected you know we couldn't have written that or planned it but it just happened and it could have been extremely unexpected it's not only teaching a lesson but it's allowing us to feel stronger to be stronger and at some point in our future we'll look back at this mo moment where this thing has happened and we will actually think to ourselves wow, you know, that needed to happen because I learned X, Y, and C, or X, Y, and Z. I live in the UK. <laughs> That's the American influence, you know. I've been in America uh, twice um, in the last sort of seven months. You know, it's the influence, I'm telling you. Um, but, you know, that's what I'm seeing, um, that, you know, things sometimes don't make sense, but they make sense eventually, and it's going to make you stronger. You are going to get through this. I promise you will get through this. Um, you know, in, even in the darkest sort of moments, you will get through it. Um, you will. You just will. So this is your reading group number two. Um, if you have any comments, any questions, let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and if this resonated as well. Um, and definitely do check out the description box below for information on private paid readings, free reading giveaway and my bracelets which are on Etsy. Um, and yeah, I just, you know, I really do wish you the best. Um, wish you lots of that positive um, energy as well. And uh, definitely do take care of yourself and I hope you have you know, a lovely day or night whenever you're watching this and um, definitely do take care as I keep mentioning a hundred times but you will definitely get through this and um, I'm just sending you so much warmth, joy, positivity and happiness which I know for a fact you can manifest in your life and you can bring into your life and you know every night brings a new day and that's exactly what I'm seeing for you as well. Um, you know it will bring a rainbow in your life all right so take care.